today I am filming one of my most requested videos, mainly on my blog channel because I talk about it on there more, um, and it is my stretching routine. So these are the stretches that I do mainly on a day to day basis, sometimes every other day, um, and it just helps to get more flexible and that kind of thing. So uh, yeah, I thought I would share them with you because so many of you guys have asked what I do. Um, I'm just going to put it out there. I don't know t like the names of things, I don't know, yeah. Basically, I just do it because it helps me get more flexible and I'm really not flexible. So yeah, let's get on with the video and I hope you enjoy it. So for this first stretch, you want to stand with your legs slightly apart and try and get your head to touch your knee. You want to do this on both legs and just kind of hold it for a little bit. Next, you want to go onto one knee and put your leg out straight in front of you and do the same thing trying to get your head to your knee. You next want to move that straight leg into a bent leg and get your hands flat on the floor and just try and push down as far as you can so you can feel a stretch right in the middle. For this next stretch I'm using my sister's stretch band and I'm putting it over my foot and trying to pull my foot as far back as possible. I often use a scarf if she doesn't let me use this. I'm next using her block and again I just use a little box and you want to try and do your splits and you want to try and get your thigh onto the box. Sometimes I have to twist the box the other way to get my thigh completely on it. So this next one looks really weird but basically you want to sit on your feet and you want to lean forward so you can feel a stretch in your ankles. I hold onto my bed to help pull my forwards and get a good stretch. So for this one you want to reach down and you want to go across your body and stretch like this. You don't want to go forwards because that's a slightly different stretch and stretches different places and you want to do this on both sides. This one again looks really weird and you want to sit on your feet and you want to get your bum as low as possible and push your legs back with your arms. This one is basically you lie on the floor and you want to stretch your leg up as far as you can using your own hands, not a stretch band. This is similar to the other one but this time you want to lean forwards and this is in a slightly different position as you can see, you're straight on. And you just want to lean forwards as far as you can, trying to keep your back as straight as possible. So for this one you want to lie on your side with your legs straight and you want to pull your leg up, you want to kick it up and you then you need to hold it with your hand and pull it as far to your head as you can and this is such a nice stretch and it's actually pretty comfortable to lie in. So this is one of my least favourite stretches um, and you want to lean forwards and you want to try and grab your ankles and get your head down to your knee. I often like to push my feet forwards from holding because that's easier for me. So for this one you want to put your back leg straight and your front leg bent and you want to push down using gravity as kind of the push force and if that's too easy then you can put your leg at a right angle. For this one you want to stand with your feet apart and you want to reach down with your arm and lift the other, one, other arm up straight and you want to do this on both sides and then you want to do it kind of more facing straight on but it's the exact same stretch. For this one you want to be in like the downward dog position and just kick your legs up and you can feel a really nice stretch and this again it just helps in stretching your legs out for the splits. This straddle stretch is one of my least favourites but it works so well and I like to lean forwards and hold my bed to pull me forwards. For this one, you want to have your back leg straight and your front leg bent and you want to be on your foot and this is such a nice stretch. This is the butterfly stretch which is my favourite and you want to push down your legs as far as possible so you can get them flat and then you want to try and get your head to your feet. I can't do it in all the places but I can do this pretty well. So for this one you want your front leg bent and on your foot and you want your back leg on your knee and you want to pull back your foot as much as possible and you want to do this on both sides, this is kind of what it looks like from the front. For this one you want to lie down and push up with your hand and pull your leg back and you want to do this on both legs again. This was pretty difficult to begin with but once you can do it it's really nice. This one again is one of my favourites and it's just standing and stretching, this is really good stretch and you want to try and keep your shoulders down. 
So for the end of the leg stretches you want to push into your splits as far as possible and keep your hips square. I feel like these stretches have helped so much with my right leg but with my left leg I can't keep my hips square so it's very difficult but um, I really couldn't go far in the splits before. This is my left leg. <laughs> so for this one this is a back stretch and you want to go on your knees and you just want to put your arms down and hold onto your ankles and just sway and this gets a really good stretch in your lower back. Then still on your knees you want to twist your arms over so they're the other ways if you were in a bridge and you want to slide down so your legs are in this position. This is honestly such a good stretch. For this one you want to go on your feet and you want to twist into kind of a back bend bridge and then you want to lift your legs up and this is such a good way to not only get more strong but also to stretch your back and I love this so much. So that is my stretching routine. I know it's not like amazing but this is the stretches that I basically do on a day to day basis so they aren't too like strenuous but they help gradually to get, help you get more flexible and my splits are getting so much further by doing these stretches and um, I'm getting closer to a back bend now as well which is really good um, so yeah I hope this helped you out and I will see you again soon with another video